Back in September, community producer Marta Balahutrek met with a local artist to learn more about her light art, concepts, techniques, and awards. However, the story isn't over. At the end of last year, her concept for a mural was selected to be displayed at a local credit union. Illuminated behind the customer service kiosk at the Chilliwack branch of the Van City Credit Union, Sylvie Roussel Janssen's new mural brings together the story of our city. I decided to feature the community of Chilliwack within the format of a quilt. I started out making quilts when I was very young and this piece feels like it's like a return or sort of a completing the circle. So what was it about Sylvie's proposal that compelled Van City's art team to choose this piece? Her proposal really spoke to so many important aspects of the character of, of Chilliwack, yeah, not just in terms of the type of artwork that she creates, but also in that her proposal was really speaking to so many different groups of people, bringing stories back into a narrative that members could uh, maybe learn about for the first time and enjoy um, through experiencing her artwork. The artwork is divided into two parts, the old and the new. So here we have an archival photos showing a threshing crew a century ago. So that's the old ways to do the work. And on the opposite side, we have uh, harvesting this fall. Oh, wow. And it was a photo um, given by Chris Clute as a counselor in Chilliwack and also a farmer. A lot of research was required for the photos. Most of the historical photos came from the Chilliwack and the Stolo archives. The Stolo archives have the photo, but um, I had permission from the private collector, which is Grace Kelly, to use it for this purpose. So she's, she was quite happy to help out. But Sylvie also has a very personal connection to this work of art and to our city, which dates back to the mid-1950s. Okay, so I'm a relatively new in Chilliwack, only 30 years. I wasn't born here. But interesting enough, my dad was at CFB Chilliwack for a couple summers in 55 and, and 56, Canadian Officer Training Corps. So at the end of the middle row, there's Jacques Roussel, my father, and the guy with the glasses. So I put this photo over here on the bottom. Creating a very large piece when working within limited space presents a challenge to any artist as they can only imagine what their work will look like once it's installed at its final destination. This is especially the case for Sylvie. I really like to do large works. I mean, to me, the larger the better. So working in a small studio, you never really get an impression of what it's really going to look like until you have the ultimate space to put it in, in terms of space and light. And it was the decision of the design team from Van City to have it backlit. And having backlit work in an interior context is, is a dream. I think this one is better. Yeah. Okay. We're just uh, adjusting a few things right now with the, the diffuser on this very specially made light sheet. So that will be fixed in the next few weeks. It's going to look quite similar to what you can see here. So I'm very, very happy to see it here. In Chilliwack, I'm Marta Balahutrak for Shaw TV.